Hey everyone, so I just got the idea <laughs> to film this uh, video. So right now I'm about to wash my hair. I'm just detangling it. I'm using, I just um, sprayed water. This is warm water on my hair in sections. And I'm using um, Herbal Essences Hello Hydration Conditioner to detangle. Um, so all I do is spray my hair, put um, like a small handful of the conditioner run it through my hair and I use this wide tooth shower comb to detangle, you know, tips first, the ends first, and then up to here. And then I'm going to put um, each quadrant, because I have four quadrants, into two twists. And then I'm going to get in the shower, wash my hair, and I'll come back and show you my deep conditioner. Alright, so now it's time to deep condition my hair. I'm using the Shea Moisture African Black Soap Purification Mask. Um, it has tea tree oil and willow bark extract. It's for dry, itchy scalp, and mine has been kind of itchy lately. So, uh, my hair's still kind of in the twist. I had to retwist some of them. They like to come out when I'm rinsing. But, um, alright, so here we go. Just open up. Here's what the product looks like. Smells okay. <laughs> Not great. Alright, so I'll take about that amount and put it on the hair. I'll undo the twist to make sure it's fully dispersed. And then retwist it. So after I'm finished with this process, I will cover my head with a plastic cap and let it um, sit for about 30 minutes.
Okay, so I have just finished washing out the deep conditioner from my hair. I find that um, usually when I wash out the deep conditioner, my hair looks so much darker. <laughs> Not sure if y'all can tell, but yeah, I remember the first time I was so surprised that it looked so much darker. Anywho, I am like so in a rush. I have a recital to go to. So I um <laughs> Not gonna end up styling my hair like I thought, but uh, I'm about to spray this Shea Moisture Dandruff, Dandruff and Dry Scalp Elixir um, on my hair and scalp. My hair is still damp. Okay. And I'll follow that up with the um, Shea Moisture Balancing Conditioner. As you can see, I got those three <laughs> things on clearance at Target recently, actually. So check your Target. So I just did one pump of the leave-in conditioner. I think I'm going to end up, I don't know, I thought I was going to have more time, but I ended up talking to my friend on the phone. <laughs> Um, right now I'm just going to put the leave-in conditioner in each section, twist it back up, and figure something out. <laughs> but normally after doing um, leave-in conditioner and some oil, I will use a styling cream and twist up my hair. All right, so this is not what I intended on doing. I intended on styling my hair today, which I can still do later, but I have an event to be at in 30 minutes, so I need to leave the house. So what I did was I twisted up, um, the plan was to like, you know, do enough twist to do an updo, but it doesn't look right. <laughs> my hair is not long enough yet, in my opinion, to do like kind of chunky twist and then have it as a wearable style. So the front looks fine, but the back is just like, what? Like not cute. So I won't be wearing that out of the house. So sometimes what I do when I'm either like, have no time to do my hair or it needs to dry <laughs> is I take my satin scarf. <clears throat> I'm gonna tie it this way actually. Just tie it on my head. I tie it a little far back so that actually I can tie it kind of like this and you'll see why in a minute so I'm just securing it in the back okay come on now So that's it. And I have this wonderful hat that I use just about every single day. And um, especially when my hair is not done, it's it's like, it's not a hairstyle, but it's, it's a nice enough hat to wear all day long. So I will be wearing this hat, QO Chemist. I want it from her in like 2009 or something like that. <laughs> anyway, um, and it's handmade by somebody else on YouTube. Sorry. <laughs> Anywho, um, so sometimes when I wear this on my head all day, what I do is I put it a little far back so you can see some of my hair. I tuck the rest of the satin scarf underneath. 
so that you can see some of my hair. And then I pin it in place because last thing I want is this thing falling off. So I just put one pin on the top of my head and two, one on either side by my ears. So that way it doesn't look like my hair is not done. It looks like I decided to do this on purpose. Oh, now you know my secret. <laughs> So anyway, product, uh, the uh, leave-in conditioner is still drying a little bit, but, um, yep, so this is my style, at least for this afternoon. <laughs> and thank you for watching. Bye!